Hello guys and welcome today. Uh, I don't even know what the date is anymore. What's the date? 18. So welcome to day 17 and 18 of Vlogmas. Okay, here's the thing. I got home so late yesterday and I was so tired and I just didn't even want to do advent calendars. Like I'm gonna wake up early tomorrow and do advent calendars for yesterday. And I went to bed at like 9.30. Oh no, oh no. Oh, what's happening? Camera, camera, you can do it. Come on, camera. Is it because of the light behind me? Camera, what's wrong with you, camera? What's what's happening? There it is, there it goes. Um, I went to bed at like 9.30 last night and I didn't wake up until like 8.30 this morning. It was crazy and it's probably because I haven't been getting a whole lot of sleep at night. Anyways, I was going to try to fake you guys out and be like, oh yeah, this is definitely day 17 of Vlogmas. And then, then the whole day passed and now it's, it's the night of the 18th and I'm like, uh oh, I didn't vlog, I didn't do anything. And so, um... Instead of lying to you guys, I'm just going to say that I'm merging these days together. It's going to be day 17 and 18 of Vlogmas, and we're just going to go with it. Um, and there's not going to be a whole lot of fun stuff because it's already nighttime. It's already... I keep wanting to look at my watch, but my, my watch died because last night when I fell asleep, I literally just fell asleep. So I didn't even, like... I didn't even charge my watch. My watch was just, it was off my wrist, but it was like on my bed, not charging. And so this morning when I put it on, it was already at 30%. I was like, oh, this thing's gonna die. So it died, it's it's done so. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the charger on it. Oh my gosh, the, oh, there it goes, there it goes. I, it's connected. Is it charging? Why is it doing that? Does that mean it's charging? Or does that mean I need to charge it? It's hooked up to the charger. I don't know. I'm gonna let it chill for a little bit and hopefully it'll fix itself. You know, one of the things I wanted to vlog today that I didn't was, there was another family that our organization was adopting and the people who were in charge of that family didn't really get a whole lot of gifts. So I had taken the paper home with me like, okay, let me see if I have anything. And surprisingly, I actually did. There was a mom and a son and the mom wanted large slide shirts. And I was like, I have tons that are brand new that I got from Amazon that didn't fit me. And I just got a bunch of joggers. And so I was actually able to come up with a few things for her. And then the son, I got excited because the son is a teenager and I thought it said that he could wear medium shirts. So I put all these shirts together that I thought were kind of like teenager friendly, like middle school friendly. I had socks, I had a couple sweatshirts, I had some um, underwear, like you know my loot, my loot underwear, because um, I think he would be like a size men small. But what happened was is I misread the paper and it was really like shirt size wise, he's a small in men's and a medium in boys and so I was like oh no but I still gave him some of those shirts anyways because he can grow into them but I was able to go to JC Penney this morning to finally pick up the order that should have been done two days ago and then I bought some other things for this other family like some jeans and some shirts and some joggers and um you know a decent spread that I think will be cool um and then tonight I went and turned everything in because they're giving all the gifts tomorrow. So I wanted to make sure that I turned everything in today. So anyways, that was eventful and chaotic. I'm so glad that it's over just because it's been really stressful the past few days to make sure that we're getting all of this stuff together. So I'm really excited. I'm so, so excited for all the families and I hope that everything goes well. But that's what I did this morning. I was like scrambling around trying to find the stuff upstairs and then going to JCPenney and getting all this stuff at the store and yeah. But what else? And then I came home. I had dinner. I came home. I got home kind of early actually. I got home at like 7.30 which is way earlier than I normally get home so that was cool. And uh, yeah I am actually really tired right now and getting ready to go to bed. I'm wondering if I did like what's happening? Is this not working? Does this mean it's charging or does this mean that it needs to be on the charger? I can't tell. It's plugged in. This is legitimately plugged in. What? Oh, there it goes. Maybe now it's charged enough to actually show up because sometimes like iPhones are like that. This is a new speaker that I got. I got this on Black Friday. It's actually a Polaroid speaker. But um, my waterproof one that I usually use in the shower is in my car. So I whipped this thing out. It's actually pretty nice, to be honest. I think it was like $15. 
but I've never really had a Bluetooth speaker like this before, and it was actually really nice and powerful. So I wanted to charge it up, make sure that it's fully charged, and then I'll leave it over there in my bathroom area. I might bring that to work with me, actually. It has good sound. I think other than that, there hasn't been much going on. I don't think so, at least. I feel a lot better. Yeah, I wasn't feeling well the past few days, but I kind of got over that, and I feel a lot better. And uh, it's Wednesday today. Wednesday, December 18th, which means two more days, and then I'm off of work for a couple weeks, which is kind of crazy to think, but I'm excited. I'm excited about it, but it's crazy. Like, it's going to be so interesting to be off like that. Uh, the last time I was off for that kind of length of time was when I was in my car accident, and I was out of work for, I think it was three weeks straight, and then f the fourth week I was in for half a week. So it's, yeah, it's kind of weird, but I'm, yeah, I'm just super excited to be able to spend some time at home. I've been getting really into organizing upstairs. Um, you probably wouldn't be able to tell yet because I don't think it's at that point yet, but I've been trying to break down boxes and like sort through things, open some of the older boxes. I do want to film that stuff for you at some point, but I don't think it'll be until after I'm not working because I think, I think it's easier for me to focus on that when I'm not working and I can wake up and edit and stuff. So what else is there? What else is there? I was going to go to Dave and Buster's tonight, but I didn't. That's excellent self-control. I think I'm going to go next Wednesday though. Is that Christmas Day? I don't know if they're open that day, but if they are, honestly, I think I might go because my family doesn't celebrate Christmas on Christmas. So I think they can't be open on Christmas Day. That would be so strange. I'm going to look and see. Even New Year's Day. I wonder. If not, I'm going to have to wait until, oh my gosh, because I only am allowed to go on Wednesdays. I don't know. Okay, let's go ahead and get our advent calendars done. I was reading some comments today and people were like, you seem over overwhelmed with the advent calendars. I definitely think every year I add more and more. Like, to have six advent calendars of just socks, it's a bit much. <laughs> I was, and a couple nights ago I was super rushing through them because I was so tired. Like, I'm not even, it was like 2.30 in the evening. I was so tired and I just knew that if I didn't do it that night, I wasn't going to do it the next morning. So... I just made the executive decision and we went with it. I also, I always apologize because, I mean, vlogs where I'm not doing anything are not fun. But it seems like you guys understand. And honestly, like, that's my life. Why does my camera not want to focus right now? Okay, I'm going to put this camera down so I can get all the boxes. All right. We are in for a treat today because we get to do, for day, was it 17? We get to do this set of calendars. For day 18, we get to do this set of calendars. And then for these ones, we get to do two days worth, which is kind of exciting. So let's start off with our Star Wars calendar. We are officially on nine. I really wanted to try to not bust up this calendar because I love some of this artwork. Like, isn't that such cool artwork? But it just wasn't going to happen. I really want to... I can't. You know what's kind of crazy, guys? Every so often I film videos and then I don't actually edit or post them. And they just sit in my, like, queue. And there's one video that has been sitting in my queue for literally a year now, almost. It was a sock calendar that I did with Jess, my cousin in Boston, and my sister. I think it might have been Marvel. I'm not quite sure. And it's just sitting there. Like, it's just sitting there. And I'm like, oh, I'm going to have to unvault that for this Christmas and throw it out there because it can't sit there any longer. Like, how long can I really let footage like that just sit? So I'm going to post that and I'm going to edit it and post it soon. So be on the lookout for that. If you miss Jess... She's coming. Also, hello Jess, I hope you're doing well. Okay, so we're on day nine, and that was for day 17. I'm just gonna rip it like this. Oh, this is interesting that this is the pair of socks that we got out of here. So that has Ray, and these are Stormtrooper socks that say move along. I love the color of these. They look really green on camera. They are pretty green. They have a tealish tint to them, which I enjoy. I'm a fan of that. Okay. I feel like that could have been like in this one, but that was full size. So yeah, I don't know. Nine. Oh, that's weird. We have to go to here. The next one, it like kind of skips. Okay. Sorry. Enough talking. More doing. Okay. So our Nickelodeon one, we're also going to go with number... Nine, we have, ow, 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 <laughs> what is that, spunky, ow, my finger, ow, that really hurt my finger, ow, man, these things can be dangerous, 
ow. You know when you just like, get that exact nailing, the thing that pulled your nail, ow. Okay. Rocco's Modern Life. Rocco's Modern Life. Okay, so these are ankle socks, and these are the, um, it's like Rocco's shirt design, but on a sock. That's cool. I'm a fan of that. I can dig it. Oh, <laughs> whoops, I just threw the calendar. Okay, and then last calendar for day 17 for socks. We are doing uh, this one. I'm still like in awe about this. Chris was wearing these socks and I was like, gosh, I can't believe Taco Cat spelled backwards is Taco Cat. Uh, this one says, I came, I saw, I complained. This is what Mac looks like most of the time. I don't even know where that guy is. Mac! Okay, let's see if I can break this one, but hopefully not kill my thumb. Uh, I don't think... I don't know. I can't do it. I can't do it. I'm just going to rip it from the top. Okay. <gasps> oh my gosh. This looks like a human face, but it says not a unicorn. That is so funny. I love those. Minus the fact that the cat looks weird, but I like that. Why does the cat... Why do they do that to the nose and the mouth? It looks strange. Like it's too far apart. Uh, anyways, okay, so that's enough sock calendars for day 17. Let's go ahead and do the sock calendars for day 18. So we have Harry Potter, and just like the other one, we're going to do day 9. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Oh, ow, nope. Ow. I'm not as strong as I thought I was. Okay, let's tear this. Here we go. First set of socks is... So they're white ankle socks, and they say... Harry Potter, and they have his glasses and his lightning bolt. I think we got socks similar to that. I think they were not ankle socks. I think they were the crew socks, but I like those. Those are cool. All right, second Harry Potter calendar. I don't know. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be these socks. These ones? Let's go with it. Oh, oh my gosh. I made a mess of this calendar. So we have another pair of ankle socks, and these say platform nine and three quarters. Mm, that's an interesting design. <laughs> and then the last calendar that we have, we're doing, oh no, is it going to be the same? What if we got the same, oh, not the same, but similar. <laughs> okay, platform nine and three quarters. Which one do you like better out of the two? I guess, <sighs> I kind of like this one because it's not so like bam in your face, but this is, I mean, I don't know. I mean, it's a design, so that's cool. Anyways, um, between these three, I think I like the Stormtrooper socks the best. I like this color scheme. And then out of these three, I think I like these Harry Potter ones the best. And out of all six of these, I still think I'd have to go for the, the Stormtrooper and then these ones as my one and two. What are your one, one and two out of those? Let me know. Okay, toy calendar time. So we're going to do Harry Potter first, and we're doing day, what day? 17 and 18. So day 17 is Dumbledore. Okay. Uh, oh my god. Oh, I just got a whiff. Of, oh, oh. I just got a whiff of the, the overly plastic smell. Ooh, that was intense. Ooh, that reminded me of Japanese snack boxes. Okay. Snape, Snape, Severus, Dumbledore. <laughs> I don't want to do that with just these, like, Where's the Snape one? I know we had a Snape one in here. Where is it? Here. <laughs> oh my god, this is gonna be so great. Watch this. I'm gonna get I'm gonna have to get Jackson to come help me in this. Ready? Snape, Snape, Severus, Snape, Dumbledore, Snape, Severus, Snape, Dumbledore. <laughs> I put a, a lot of effort to make that just now happen. Okay, so we have Dumbledore. And then number 18 is Mm. Is this Cedric? Or is this Tom Riddle? I think this is supposed to be Tom Riddle, right? It looks like... I feel like Tom Riddle and I guess Snape could look... Or not Snape, um, Cedric Diggory could look very similar. Uh-oh. Who is this? This Doesn't it really look like Cedric Diggory? Doesn't it look more like Tom Riddle? I think Tom, Cedric Diggory is going to be number 21. Okay, you guys tell me. What do you think? What do you think? 
Tom Riddle, or Cedric Diggory. Okay, next we're going to do our Lego Advent Calendar. Um, I do owe you a build from day 16 still. And then day 17 is... Okay, well at some point my camera stopped recording and I don't really know when. It looked like I showed you guys the Hubble look like, and this was day 18, and I was saying that I don't actually know who that is. It looks like it's the um, the one instructor that goes, Wingardium Leviosa. But I forget what his name is, and it doesn't really look like him. But I don't... It, isn't it him? This guy looks full size, though. Is he on the cover? No. What's the teacher's name? Ah, now I... <sighs> well, anyways, I'm going to build all of these. So this was from the 16th, and then today's, or no, I'm sorry, yesterday's and then today's. So I'll build these really quick, and then I will show you guys. Here's the thing. I understand the whole thing about losing pieces, and we're going to give you extra pieces. But for this figure, they gave me three bow ties. Three bow ties. What? Why do I need three bow ties? Like, if I lose one bow tie, that's already more, that's like ridiculous. If I lose two bow ties, I just don't even know. This head has two faces, but the faces are the same on both sides. Isn't that funny? It's literally the same, the same face. Oh, maybe it's a little bit different. Okay, I'm going to keep building. Okay, here are my masterpieces. So we have this teacher which I still think is a teacher that teaches Wingardium Leviosa. Uh, we have, actually, was that in Goblet of Fire? That was not. Is this it from Goblet of Fire? Actually, I don't know if this is from Goblet I'm getting it confused with this calendar. Okay, anyways, there he is with his three extra bow ties that they gave me. I put those in the box already. And then we have our Hufflepuff flag, which is cool. And then this is our little chessboard. Look at the extra pieces they gave me. They actually gave me two extras of the little Lego men, which is, I'm excited for that because these are cute. I like those. Okay, so we're gonna dump all the extra pieces back in here, put that in there, put this in there, and put him up here. And this Lego calendar is done for yesterday and today. Okay, here's our Marvel calendar. Again, we're doing day 17, boom. Oh, this is, isn't this, wait, isn't this Vision, oh, Vision, but in comic book form, because he looks different? I think he is Vision, right? I think he's Vision. I don't know. 18 is Rocket. Oh, he looks evil. Look at this Rocket. Oh, he looks really aggressive. Are those boxing mitts on his hands? No, he just has red gloves. Look how angry he looks. Ooh. Oh, I'm not. I'm definitely not a fan of that one. This one's cool. I like the color scheme. This looks like Doctor Strange, though, just with different colors. Is that actually the same mold? No, it's not. Doctor Strange. No, not Doctor Strange. What's... You guys said that this one was Black Panther? No, I mean, they're a little bit different. All right, anyways, there we go. That's what we have. Let's see if the second Marvel calendar has the same variants or if they're different. I can't imagine that they gave us variants of those characters. Same for that one. This calendar is much harder to open. The corrugation is not great. Same for Rocket. Okay, so that's going to stay in there. And then last, but definitely not nice. Oops, it's upside down. Is our Pokemon Advent Calendar. I think this is what I look forward to the most, to be honest. Alright, let's do this. Let's do this. We're doing day 17. Woo! Oh, yeah, I just went for it that time. What do we, oh, we have the Unified Mind. So I haven't opened this pack yet, so that's exciting. And then day 18. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Amy better come over quick. Oh, my gosh. Uh-oh, we have two Unified Minds. That means that some of these packs are going to be not great ones. Oh, I forgot. I did tell you guys about this. So here's my Bulbasaur tin. Um, we can open that, too, just to see what's in there. Maybe we don't open the packs. Maybe we add the packs to some of the later days, just so there's two packs in those ones. Okay, let us let me set up the camera. Okay, let's open this tin just to see what we have. I can imagine it's going to be the same, whatever came out of the other tins, which I don't really remember off the top of my head, but we have our, oh, look at this goopy goop that's on here. What is, the, why is it on this? Ew. 
Gross. Okay. Um, oh, look, another one of these coins. We keep getting the same coin. And then we have our artwork. So there's that. And then we have Sun and Moon Burning Shadows and Evolution. So I'm pretty sure those are the same. Since, actually, well, I'll show you guys after we're done opening these two Unified Minds packs. I only bought three each of the new ones and this will be once I open these two today that means I'll only have one of each left but I think I might just slip these packs into day 23 and 24 maybe just so the last two days we have three packs each all right anyways let's go ahead and do this this was for day 17 so this is our first day oh my camera doesn't like the focus on here hold on let me tap it there we go okay so we have our first pack of unified minds Let's go and see what we got. Camera angle is super funky. Okay, up oh, green code card, so probably nothing good. For those who play Pokemon TCG online, here is the code card for Unified Minds. All right, well, we're gonna do three cards, four cards is the trick. And let's check it out. We have energy. Blue's Tactics. At the end of this turn, draw cards until you have eight cards in your hand. Oh, that's a cool one. Fireworks. Discard. Yeah, Lampant. Eh. Musharna. That's a new one. I've never seen that. Han. Hanich. Hanich. Sneasel. Magnemite. Slakoth. Oh, I like that one. Oh, I like this one. Turn your points next turn. If they touch an energy from their hand, from their hand to the defending Pokemon, their turn ends. Oh, that's interesting. Exu. A reverse is a Drift Blim. And this is another rare card. So we've been pulling a lot of rare um, reverses, which is cool. And our regular rare is Necrozma. 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 I think I say Necrozma. Necrozma. Okay. So we didn't hit big on that one. I really like this, this sloth card. I think might be one of my new favorite Pokemon cards. All right, let's do this one. This is for day 18, so today. This is a cute little picture of Mew and Mewtwo. All right. White or green? White or green? Ah, oh, no, green. Green. Boo. Okay, let's see, focus. Oh, my camera's struggling so hard today. Okay, there's the code card for that pack. One, two, three, four. Boom, boom, bam. And let's go for it. All right, here we go. Dragonair. Tortuga. Tortuga. Giant Hearth. Once during each player's turn, that player may discard a card from their hand. If they do, that player searches their deck for up to two energy cards, reveals them, and puts them in their hand. Then that player shuffles their deck. Oh, that's interesting. Fletch... Fletchender. Stunfisk. Onyx. Fineon. What if it was your job to name these Pokemon? I mean, kind of a cool job. Ooh, a Lonely Grimer. That one's creepy looking. Okay. Our reverse is not a rare card this time. This is Honedge, which we just got in the last one, but the artwork is different. That's our reverse holo. And our regular rare is Tapu Fini. Oh, Tapu Fini, that's an interesting um, rare. I only know these from like the GX EX cards or whatever. All right, so we didn't pull anything good from those. I think what I might do is I'm gonna open up the calendar and I'm going to pop these on the 23rd and 24th slots that we have three packs for each of those days. So let's see, 23, 24. We're gonna go ahead and open this up. Do we at least have good packs? Oh, Cosmic Eclipse for that one. I'm cheating, I'm sorry. Sun and Moon, let's make it something fun. Okay, I'm switching these. I'm switching these. I know I shouldn't do that, but I'm going to. Okay, put these back on there. I shouldn't have done that, but you guys, I can't help it. I can't help it. I want the last days to be the best days, you know? Or at least unboxing cool packs. Okay. Oh no, why isn't it closing? It's not closing because it hates me. It's like, oh, you shouldn't have done that. Okay, there we go. All right, there you go. That's our advent calendars for the day. All right, guys. Lame vlog for the past two days. My apologies. It'll be better. It'll be better, trust me. Coming up soon, it's going to be so good. 
I can't confirm or deny that. But look who's here. Hi, Mac. Mac, come over here. Come here. Mac, come here. Come here, buddy. Mac. He's over there near the heater. Hi. Come on. You used to love the camera. I know you like it. Come on. Hi, bud. Hello. He's got this little dirt on his nose, and I tried to scratch it off of him, and he got really upset, so I stopped. This mark right here, do you see this on my arm? Last night, he was on the couch, and so was Lilo, and I tried to... <laughs> I tried to put him really close to Lilo like <laughs> it was a dumb idea and Lilo like because he can't he's, he's a little bit spazzy sometimes he like freaked out and he basically like swung his head around and him and Lilo's face were like this close together and then Mac hissed and then I tried to like move him and then he scratched me and then he went down on the ground so that was not a smart idea not smart huh Mac not not a smart idea. I don't usually make dumb ideas like that, but sometimes, every so often, I do. All right, well, I think we are going to end it here. My boxes are starting to pile up, so tom for tomorrow's vlog, I might actually do some unboxing on this channel instead of doing even the separate, like, quick unboxing. I'm not quite sure. I might wake up tomorrow, though, and, and feel, like, really motivated to do a couple unboxing videos, so I might do that. We'll see. We'll see how it goes when I wake up. But thank you for joining me today and yesterday for Vlogmas. I'm so sorry. I was I was so like into like really making sure that I vlogged every day. But I also realistically know that that's challenging. And um, especially from coming off of sickness, I didn't want to overwhelm myself. So Mac is using my camera as a scratching post now. Can you hear him? I don't know if you can hear him purring. I'll scratch you, Mac. I'll scratch you. Okay. Well, I hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you guys again tomorrow. See you later. Bye. Wait a second. Mac wants to say bye. See you later. Bye. Oh.